Well, folks, this is it. I've trapped myself in the dog kennel. It's like I'm locked in and I can't get out. So this is liable to be my last video. Yeah, right. You might think this little bitty wired thing's going to keep me in or lock me up. Uh, bad luck, Snake. Hush! I'm trying to make a video. Don't be complaining. Shut up! You me? Hell living with a bunch of dogs. Anyway, what was I? Oh, the president's got it partially right on uh, what he got made fun of about shining the light to kill the virus. Well, you know what? There is the UV germicidal light. It's being used, and it can be used to open up a lot of buildings. It can be used to sanitize the air. If these churches want to open and stuff, they ain't got to do much. They just make their place safer. You know, just kill a few bugs and, you know, everything's safer for everybody. You know, put a little ozone in the air. Not much. Just enough where when people walk in, they can maybe detect the scent of it. That's that's about the perfect level of ozone. When you walk in the building and, and you can just barely t detect that little bit of smell of ozone, you got the level set right. Guess what? That'll make that toilet paper flu die too. It'll shrivel up, it'll go in that air, and it'll be going, ew, ew, get away, get away, get away, get away. Anyway, so that's one of my ideas. Another is just to create the ozone by uh, running the air through some big old humongous filters, you know, like, Put a fan on the end of uh, one of those 20 by 30 air conditioning filters, and on the back side of it, you put a UV light. See, that UV light is also sanitizing any air that flows through, and it's putting out just a little bit of ozone out there, you know, and it's circulating the air, good, clean air. Just can't help, and then, you know, the books and stuff in the uh, church, even the Bible. I know this might be sacrilegious, but... That paper can be treated where it'd be germ-free, or germs would have a hard time living on it. Uh, I can take colloidal silver. Germs don't grow well on silver. Hmm? Just spray it on the paper. It soaks in. Guess what? It's there. It's embedded in the fibers. It doesn't. It's not a conducive atmosphere for bugs to drop to grow, or the little tiny ones we're concerned about now. So. The president ain't got it wrong. He just shining the light in the wrong spot, Mr. President. We need to shine it on the outside of our bodies. Let's say, here's a good thing, and I'm sure the government does it in some contaminated areas. You walk into a room, you close your eyes, and, and you turn around, and, and you get blasted by UV light for just a little while, you know, after your shower. Not enough to even give you a suntan, but enough to uh, disturb any bugs on you. I guess that's about it for this video. Hopefully I'll be able to get out of this cage sometime, sooner or later.